Now on the inside. And on our steering wheel we have our audio controls as well as Bluetooth. And then we're also going to control some of our Honda sensing features. Uh, these features consist of adaptive cruise control, which is a radar based cruise control that keeps you a set distance to the vehicle in front of you. We also have your lane keep assist that will keep you centered in your lane. Other features consist of your collision mitigation as well as your road departure mitigation. Uh, putting the vehicle in gear is a little different on the pilot considering that we have a nine speed automatic transmission uh, with all push button. So no more traditional gear shift in the Elite Pilot. Your eight inch display here will display several different options for you. Uh, probably the three most important is gonna be your audio. You also have your phone button. So you can press that, that allows us to make and take Bluetooth phone calls, and probably most importantly is our Garmin navigation. This is a very, very easy system to use. Uh, allows you to search for destinations and set waypoints, and also gives you up-to-date traffic information. We're gonna go and open up this rear door here on the driver's side. Honda has installed a little push button on your two captain's chairs, and with the push of that, it allows kids easy access to the rear or third row seat. It is spring loaded, all you have to do is slide the chair back and you're on. A lot of convenience features and comfort features to talk about as well. We have our tri climate zone. So, what that allows, it allows my driver to have their own temperature, the passenger to have their own temperature, and then our entire rear compartment to have an own temperature. You also have your heated captain's chairs as well as heated and cooled front seats. Looking up at the ceiling, we have our Blu ray DVD as well as our panoramic sunroof, which is only offered in the Elite, gives it a really high class feel. 